Welcome back to Landship Scorpius. I am Lieutenant Nathaniel Flint, and we're here continuing our walkthrough. Hopefully this is a very mini step. It's the side quest for Artem the Bear, or AKA the Moon-Faced Cave Bear for the zoo in Gearford. So we just finished up our little thing in Rhine Manor. Uh, we're here at the um, headquarters of Fortress Industries in Whitehaven. And we just finished up that main fight. So we're here. We can use our lab key to open this gate. There are some things you need to do before you can do this. One, you need to complete this section of the game. You need to uncover, uh, spoiler alert if you're worried about that, um, for the main quest. You need to complete this section, the Rhine Manor section and basically get the reveal of Lord Whitmore and everything. You also need to have Cage 3, so you need to have done the Goblin uh, Master's quest lines, uh, which we prior did a video for, to get up to this point to get Cage 3, because Cage 3 is for bigger and meaner animals. So you definitely need that bigger and meaner cage. Um, also, um, Without spoiling too much, I still want some uh, surprises there for certain people, but uh, you might also have more options if you decided to do Casey's quest line before getting this far. We haven't done a video on Casey's quest line yet. Um, so without further ado, you get the lab key and you can open up this door. You open the gate and now you can approach the bear. Uh, I will remind you to save often. Do you want to try to catch it? Yes, we do for the purpose. The bear looks aggravated. It could be dangerous. We can try to entice the bear or we can attack to subdue the bear. Let's try to entice it and see how that goes. You have nothing that the bear wants. Oh, and then we're given a chance to leave if we want to. Do we want to try to catch it? Yes. So for the purposes, I guess we're going to have to attack it. So the bear is threatened by you and you get ready for a fight. And we're fighting a moon-faced cave bear. Ooh, boy, 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 boy. This is not a simple one. For the purposes of the walkthrough, I'm going to grenade it. And hope that that does enough damage to give us a little bit of a chance here. Ooh, not a lot of a chance. Okay. If you're wondering, the bear is quite, quite a fight. Um, you definitely want to use specials. You want to make sure you have good guns. Um, ooh, which apparently I had the right amount there. I'm sure those two grenades helped a lot. Uh, so, you finish the fight with the bear. The bear has been subdued. You put it in the cage before it wakes. You should be safe to transport now. Who is this? Hey, you! That bear is mine! What? Yes it is! That bear is mine! Yes, well, I followed my contacts and did some investigating. I came for my bear. And what the hell do I see? You! You hurting my bear! You! What the hell do you have to say for yourself? Well, I am waiting. Speak before I kill you. And here we have a little uh, puzzle. It's a quest tree that loops infinitely. So you need to find your way out. It's like a little uh, dialogue maze. I don't know if it's clever or annoying. But let's see uh, if we go through it. So let's call it self-defense. Are you kidding me? Self-defense? What the hell happened? Well, he attacked me. I bet, in self-defense, the natural reaction to an idiot trying to kill you. Try again. Well, self-defense. Are you kidding? Self-defense? What happened? Well, I was forced to. Oh, come on, please. So if that's the case, why were you in its cage? If it is so dangerous, why did you open the cage? Try again. That's not really working. Um, we'll try self-defense again. He broke into my cage. I, uh, what? There's no, are you insane? Try again. 
We'll, we'll go through all these. This is fun. He asked me to. I, I'm unsure of if you are messing with me or if you think I'm stupid. Try again. All right. Self-defense ain't the way to go. So we're going to do, we're rescuing it. Rescue? A rescue? Explain to me exactly how this is a rescue, huh? He's hurt. Well, yeah, that tends to happen when some idiot riddles you with bullets and wounds. I have never tried again. We tried to rescue it. Rescue, a rescue? Explain to me exactly how this is a rescue. We have better facilities. What do you mean, we have better facilities? The Gifford Zoo? What? Is this how you treat your animals? Who are you? Are you serious? So what? Are you going to fix your mistake? Well, I don't know. I want him to be okay, you see. I've had him since he was a cub. He's mine, you understand. I only want what's best for him. I do have to work a lot while I'm here. Well, I don't have much time here. Let's talk about this at the zoo. I'll see you there. Do not make me have to find you. If any more harm comes to my bear, I swear, you will regret the day you met Astrid Westergaard. Who's a character on the website? Apparently I found the right answer by trial and error. Uh, so there you go. I know that there are at least two ways to win that back and forth. But uh, why don't we head to the zoo and we will finish this. All right, we've returned to the zoo. And let's go inform Fauna of our little friend. I believe in you, Val. A goblin is just what this place needs. Still no goblin? There's a man in Whitehaven who should be able to help us. Yep, we're still doing that. Yes, this is huge. A moon-faced cave bear? That's amazing. I love it. Now we're talking. Things are starting to move. Now we'll start bringing in customers. And there he is. And apparently that's all that that... That's all where that stops. It's just right there. I was pretty sure Astrid was supposed to come by and have more to say about the bear being at the zoo. Uh, but apparently that's where that ends. So there we are. Well, that is getting the bear for the zoo. And we'll have to do uh, more later uh, with the bear um, or with Astrid's character. So for now, that's this quick video. Now we have the bear in the zoo. As you can see, our zoo is starting to get more and more lively as we've continued with the game. Uh, more animals and more people are showing up at the zoo. That's always fun and enticing. And that's all that this is. Let's make this a nice, short, clean video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you're interested in other walkthroughs, you can follow the main quest line on our playlist or on my channel for Wild Aras. We are going through the main quest line of the game to make a video walkthrough for the game. Uh, if you're interested in playing this game for yourself and trying it out, it is down below in the comments, Wild Aras over on itch.io. It is a free game. You do not have to buy it. It is a free download for Windows, Mac, and Linux. Uh, there might be some other things, but Windows, Macs, and Linux are the big three that uh, most people ask about um it is free 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 uh if you like the game or even if you don't we need reviews for the game so do remember to leave a review if you end up playing it like it hate it anywhere in between uh those reviews will help us out our reviews so far have been so kind thank you guys so much for leaving reviews uh, I appreciate it. They are worth their weight in gold right now uh, to get the game seen by more people. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Check out the other videos if you're stuck in Wild Arras, um, or just give it a shot yourself. I can't wait to hear about your journeys through the game. And with that, I thank you guys all for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!